Hello everyone, it's me, Der Diablo, Delboy D, IMF into Miami firm, Red Army South Florida, Miami Casuals, I'm coming to you special, uh, and this is something real serious, you know, I make my videos, I think it's comedy or satire, obviously I like hooliganism, I'm into fighting and so forth, I've been involved in gangs in the past and everything like that, so like, subscribe, do all the things you're supposed to do, but thing about it is, uh, with all the people I've, I've been bantering with and going at it with and stuff, I think we all know it's in the spirit of fun and everything like that. Maybe some people take it a little more serious, but uh, I've got myself in a bit of a jam uh, with this fella. He's uh, basically known as an arch criminal, uh, criminal mastermind or a serious gangster in England uh, beyond even the football stuff. And this guy, his name is George Mumby. He's also known as Babyface Mumby. And he's one of the top boys of Scunthorpe, Scunthorpe Casuals. And uh, I just left a meeting now, man. I got this dossier here on some of, him, some of his stuff. I don't hope it's accurate. I don't know if it's accurate. But, um, you know, I've been going through with this lad. I thought it was in good spirit of fun. And then uh, I posted a video. He, he told me that he didn't want me to post a video. First of all, I told him I made a video that involved him. He told me not to post it, but I'm like, man, what, what, how, what do you think you tell me what to do? So anyway, man, I posted and everything like that. And then he told me to take it down. And I'm like, yeah, whatever. Now I wake up this morning, and there's a wooden hobby horse in my bed. Now the thing about it is, I was wondering, wait a minute, is that from this guy? Does he know where I'm, li where I'm living and everything like that? Can he get at me from over across the ocean? I thought I rushed it off, right? I went back to my computer, but I see he made a comment on my YouTube. So I responded back to that. Just now, after that, when I went out, I was playing some football. Hopefully I can try for Inter Miami soon. Then. I come home, I go take a bath, there's a rubber ducky in there, in my, in my damn bathtub. So what the bloody hell, I'm gonna rub a ducky. I look at it, made in Scunthorpe. I said, uh oh, I went back and looked at that wooden horse, also made in Scunthorpe. So, Babyface, George Mumby, you've made your point, all right? But uh, I, I prefer that we could work together. So I apologize, and I apologize to Scunthorpe because I didn't know you had a guy like this involved with you that had this sort of grip in the criminal world, you know? Uh, so, I'd like to prefer to work with you, and I'm putting together a legion of doom, of internet hooligans. I got Maniac Mitchell, the maniacal Maniac Mitchell. I, we have the fantastic Steve Dolan, fantasy-based. You have Ryan Tolan, the sidewinder, the wind-up expert, the wind-up merchant extraordinaire. And you also have Mr. Let's Boom, Lee John. And Babyface Mumby, I'd like to add you in with us, brother. But I don't take kindly to people doing stuff in my house and everything like that. And in this dossier, it got a lot of stuff about him that I'm finding out. Uh, now, he going around saying that Jordan Langdon is the top boy of Scunthorpe, but we think that it's just a decoy, to, to, so we don't know that that, hit that that it's really him at the top. That's what I think. And the thing is, he, he's, I think he's only in middle school, he's, he, but, uh, but they say that in, in the playgrounds, he got tidy little hustle. He controlling all the hard candy. Uh, he controlling all the garbage pail kid co uh, cards and everything like that, and the football cards and stuff like that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I don't know if his dudes is around here now. And then there, there was a man found dead not long ago near Scunthorpe. And that man was found face down in the kiddie pool. Yeah, and then they knew it was him on account of the fact is there was a sippy cup left there. That's his trademark. And in there was lager and lemonade. That's what he drank. And the only bad thing is, though, the, or the worst thing about it is, the police can't keep him in jail. You can't imprison him because he's too small. He can slip right through the bars. All he can lay down flat. He can go underneath the doors. Yeah, man, he's a secret weapon because his firm can, he's so small you can put him in an envelope and you can mail him to your enemies and everything. And also, he got a special car. That's what I'm finding out here. He got a special car. It, it got oil slick, it got smoke screen, he can jump. It, they say he could go on the water. Thing about it is, he's so short, his, fit, his feet don't reach the pedals. So they got some special telescopic pedals. And what that enables him to do is go outside the sunroof with a slingshot and do drive-bys with a slingshot. So brother, all the stuff I'm finding out about this, this man, I see he's nothing to be trifled with, so a baby face, I don't want a problem with you, I want to work with you, brother. I want to bring you to America, and together we can do some stuff, see what you can do over here. That's all for now.